Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. The Rebels are really hitting their stride. Look, I know they have a winning streak going, but more importantly, they're starting to play at a very high level. The expectations are going to rise. They'll try to make sure their performance does the same. That's going to do it for us here on the pregame show. NCAA Football 14 action coming at you right now. Fred Nessler and Kirk Herbstreit. Teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. Across the 30. Heading for the corner. He's knocked out of bounds. Gains his way to the 40. And he throws it away. Arkansas is not only looking to win this one, but they could set some records along the way. He's to the 40. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. And they push him out right around the 42-yard line. tackled at the 50-yard line. He's at the 40. Gets out to around the 35. Did you see how much space there was? Now he tries to buy some time. Caught open field. Inside the 10. Touchdown. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. And he is drilled to 39-yard line. And they get nice yardage on that run. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. And they make the stop around the 46. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And down he goes. He scrambled. He's taken down at the 27. He's tackled at the 26. He's on the run. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Dives for extra yardage. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. Nice run there. Complete brought down, nothing doing. Nothing going on that one. So it's fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. Kicks up, and it's through the upright. When this quarterback is on, he is on. 
It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force them into a mistake. He steps out at the 32. Got some open field. Tackle made right around midfield. at the 40. This guy just made those 10 yards look easy. He's scrambling. And he hauls it in. And he's taken down at the two. Touchdown, Rebels! It's not quite a blowout, but unless they do something here, it might turn into one. the 30-yard line. They'll bring him down around the 41-yard line. They'll make the sack. That's a great tackle at the 39. Man, watch out here. He gets hit out of bounds at the 49. That's good for a game. 14, watch 14. There's a strike complete, and he tackles him hard at the 37. Now he's scrambling, trying to get it to the tight end, but it falls to the ground. There's a play fake. Looking left, finds his fullback. Rivera picks up six yards. He did not get to the first down marker. Nice run, and he's brought down. Makes it out to about the 36. He fights forward to about the 33. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Fires out quick, it's picked off. Has some daylight. And they'll return this one all the way. Inside the 10. He'll take it all away for the touchdown. Fires that quickly incomplete. And he shoved out of bounds. And he's tackled right around the 48-yard line. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And they make the stop. Here's an opening. Runs right for a nice game. Good tackle there in space. He's going to try and scramble. Under heavy pressure. He lost the ball. Touchdown, Mississippi. Tries to scramble, but he's sacked. The protection broke down. Scrambling around. He's taken down at the 28. Ole Miss is going to use their first time out of... He's out of bounds at the 35. Now he tries to buy some time. Throws complete. He's got space to work. He's tackled at the 40-yard line. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. And 
Down he goes at the 28-yard line. He scrambles. He's on the run. They bring him down. You can credit some of that to the blitz. The offensive line just wasn't able to hit. Fires to his tight end. Nothing doing. He gets it up. And it's good. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Tackle the 39-yard line. He chucks it downfield. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Can throw it as it should be the last play before the half. It falls incomplete. And that'll do it. We head to the break. Still plenty of time left in this one. 24-10, Rebels. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. We have a two-score game at the break. No surprise so far in terms of what the scoreboard says, but maybe a little surprising for some of the players on this team who, who sort of relished in that underdog role and said, we're going to bring this team to their knees. You're going to talk like that. you got to walk that aisle, baby. you got to walk that aisle. Uh, you better back it up. And right now, they're the team that's been brought to their knees. And they better stand up a lot because it's been, it's been a bad first half, especially when you're that confident. And when you start chirping a little bit, I, I think that you put the other team on notice, the team that's favored. Usually, usually you like to keep that bottle up inside. But they did the chirping. But right now, their game's got to step it up big time if they want to try to pull this upset because they've dug themselves a pretty good hole. We've done what we can do here at halftime. Time to get you back out to the second half. We'll keep an eye on everything going on in college football. Brad Nessler and Kirk Herbstreet ready with a call. And we Mitchell welcome you back to the time. action here. Just about set for the second half. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. For the 20, for the 10, touchdown, big play. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 37. He's on the run. Brought down around the 40-yard line. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. He gets hit out of bounds around the 48-yard line. He hits him hard at the 49-yard line. There's a strike complete. They'll bring him down at the 42. Up the middle for a nice game. So he calls his own number. He's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. Tackle made at the 42-yard line. It's a bad play overall by the offense. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. This guy has that innate ability. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. He'll take it all the way for the touchdown. Not a whole lot's been working for them so far. They should just come out and play loose and easy because they've got nothing to lose. Now 
now he's scrambling. And he's tackled at the 47. He's going to try and scramble. Scrambling around. Ball is loose. Fumble. Offense falls on it. Good Passes to the wide out, and he can't pull it in. Can't blame him for not hanging on to that. He goes downtown. Oh, what an interception. And he tackles him hard. Ole Miss up by a bunch. Throws it in a hurry. And they push him out at the 46. He laterals. And he's taken down around the 44-yard line. That gives him a total of 100 yards on his carry. He has some room. Touchdown, Mississippi. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. Quick pass. And they make the stop at about the 43-yard line. He's taken down at the 47-yard line. Now he tries to buy some time. He's tackled around the 42-yard line. Slings it. And down he goes around the 37-yard line. Out of bounds at the 33-yard line. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Play and it's going to be first and goal. Ready, run. Nice run up the middle. Tackle at the three. Defense and their short yardage package. I'm pretty sure they won't win it, but they haven't quit yet. He scrambled. And he is drilled at the 41-yard line. They'll get the first down. And he's hit immediately. Has some daylight. Makes it out to about the 30. Level at the 18 yard line. What a play to set him up with a first and Pitch out, and he is hit immediately. Loss of one on the toss play. He's on the run. Rhodes, and he's got the fullback. Touchdown. I don't expect any once in a lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. Out quickly to the tailback. That's a great tackle. Dumps it complete to the halfback over the middle. Brought down at about the 37 yard line. Crosses to the running back and he pulls in another one. They'll bring him down right around the 38 yard line. He's scrambling and he's going to be sacked for a loss. With five receivers. Gets it out in a hurry. Let's try to come up with an exotic blitz look to try to get him on his heels as opposed to being the aggressor and attacking the defense. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Pass 
That's right. Running back's got it. Tackle made at the 41. He fights forward to about the 43. Excellent open field tackle. Makes it to the 42-yard line. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Gets out to around the 15. And that should do it. Our final tally in this one. Ole Miss, 52. Arkansas, 17. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. Well, there is no question as to who the better team was today, Brad. Arkansas did not believe that they had a chance in this one from the start. You could see it in their eyes. You know what? Football is not just a game of brawn or muscle. It's a game that also requires a lot of mental preparation. These guys were not mentally prepared to win this football game. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kerbstreet, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.